Hey guys, it's Jim Bear, and today our topic is things to know about cosplay and just costuming if you don't know what cosplay is, although I'm hoping you do. And so, yeah, let's just hop right into it. So, to start off, if you see me look like down here, like where I'm looking right now, that's because I have my phone up with like a whole bunch of notes and stuff because I forget things a lot. So yeah, so yeah. So let's just hop right into things. Um when when you're picking a good character to replicate, um you are going to want to find the right character for you Every, and everybody is different so I came up with a list of questions and things as to answer as you are picking the right character for you so um, if you want you can pause the video right now and go get a piece of paper or your laptop or whatever or anything you can take notes on and just write down the questions as I am saying them and then right next to them you can answer them and you can keep the questions for like if you go to a con every year um, you can re reuse it every year for like Halloween or cons or just a costume party or just if you just feel like wearing a costume out and about to like lunch or something or just around your house or if you're just experimenting for fun because I know I do that a lot so yeah so go grab something you can take notes with and let's get started so the first one is what type of thing do you like do you like books or shows or video games or movies or just whatever and if you choose books what kind of books do you like just novels do you like comics or short stories or creepy pastas even or just whatever um so that's books if you choose shows what kind of shows do you like american cartoons do you like british tv shows do you like animated or do you like live action? What about animes? So yeah, um, for games, what kind of game? Do you, do you like computer games? Do you like Wii games? Do you like what kind? You like action, first person shooter, or just, do you like old video games like Donkey Kong, Pac-Man, Galaga, Mini Millipede. Right? Or is it centipede? I don't remember. Millipede. I think that's what it is. Yeah. For Christmas, my dad got this, like, giant. It's like a coffee table, but it's, like, old arcade games. It's so much fun. I'm just glad it has Donkey Kong on it, because that's my favorite video game of all time. So, yeah, what kind of games do you like? What about movies? Do you like live action? Do you like anime movies? It's basically the same thing as show. Like, same questions as show, basically. But. So, yeah. So, answer that question first. Give you a minute. So, just have at it. Think. Brainstorm. Take it all in. That was weird. Okay. So, yeah. So, the next question I have is, now that you have your answer to that, what what's the fandom? For people of you, for you people who don't know what fandom is, it's like 
a show or a game or movie or whatever. So, I'm gonna move this closer. I'm like so far away. Ah, that's better. Hello, me. Okay, so that's better. So, what fandom? Do you like Kogios? Do you like The Hunger Games? Do you like The Hobbit? Do you like Mario? Or what do you like? So, yeah. And each year, or each time you cosplay, think of a different fandom you like. Like, last year I did a musical. And this year I'm doing an anime. So, what kind of things do you like? Um, once you got your gender, I mean, once you have your fandom in mind, like, so, the, my answer for the first question would be, I like shows. What kind of show? Animes. And for the second one, fandom, right now I am really into Princess Tutu. So, that's what I'm doing this year. And then... The next question would be, which gender? Obviously, for me, if you know me, I like to do girls, because, you know, I am a girl, so. It'd be kind of hard to do a guy. I mean, not really, but, like, I just think that concept is weird. A lot of people like it, though. So, um, you do, um, you know what? necessarily have to do gender bent but like yeah I mean you can do gender bent that'd be really cool <laughs> if you did but uh, yeah like if you want to do a guy uh, like if you really liked a guy character but you want to do a girl do gender bent <laughs> find a way to sketch it out I always like to sketch out my cosplays on um, like a piece of notebook paper or something or in my sketchbook or whatever so yeah so think of a gender and then once you know what gender you're doing like since I'm doing a girl obviously because I mentioned that earlier um pick your character that sticks with all of those so the first question type of thing Stick with that answer. And take that answer and put it into the next question. Fandom. What anime do I like? That's what I think. Like, I think of the answer for the first one, show. Okay, what type of show? Anime. So, that first question is answered. So, I, so I take, an I think, anime. And put it in... To the next question. Fandom. Well, what kind of fan? What what anime do I like? What anime am I going to right now? Sorry. My friend just texted me back. Hold that thought. Sorry, my friend is being weird. Okay, so, once, I think, anime. Anime, anime, anime. My sister is singing. And here comes Johnny! Johnny! Johnny Rocket! Give me a John John! He's my baby! Come here! Ugh. Ugh. Come here! Ugh. 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 He's the best puppy in the world. Say hi. Mm. He has muddy feet though, because it's raining. Sorry, John John. It was just my phone, I'm sorry. Bye bye. My puppy is very strange. Okay. I'm scared him. Okay. So.
So then I think, what anime do I like? Well, I'm really into Princess Tutu right now. So I think, obviously, the first thing that comes to mind is Princess Tutu. So that's a really good anime, by the way. You should go watch it. It's really good. And take that answer and put it into the next question, fandom. What anime do I like? That's what I think. Like, I think of the answer for the first one, show. Okay, what type of show? Anime. So, that first question is answered. So, I so I take, an, I think, anime. And put it in to the next question. Fandom. Well, what kind of fan? What, what anime do I like? What anime am I really into right now? Sorry, my friend just texted me back. Hold that thought. Okay, sorry, my friend is being weird. Okay, so, once, I think anime. Anime, anime, anime. My sister is singing. And here comes Johnny! Johnny! Johnny Rocket! Give me a jump, John! Here's my baby! Come here! Ugh. Ugh. Come here! He's the best puppy in the world. Say hi. Mm. He has muddy feet though, because it's raining. Sorry, John John. It was just my phone, I'm sorry. Bye bye. My puppy was very strange. Okay, I think so. I scared him. Okay, so then I think, what anime do I like? Well, I'm really into Princess Tutu right now. So, I think, obviously, the first thing that comes to mind is Princess Tutu. So, that's a really good anime, by the way. You should go watch it. It's really good. Um, so then, I have fandom. I have my fandom. So I take, think Princess Tutu, or gender, obviously girl. So I take those two combined. Well, what's a girl from Princess Tutu that, oh, excuse me, that I really like? Well, obviously, Princess Tutu from Princess Tutu. Because she's the main character, and she's a girl. And so, yeah. And she's just plain awesome. What is it doing? There we go. Okay, so Princess Tutu. From Princess Tutu. Main character, girl. There we go. So now that those first four are answered, then you move on to the next one. The fifth one is What's your personality? Well, I like to dance. I like to be awesome and crazy. So there we go. So then you think, does your personality match that character? If it does, awesome! You move on to the next question. If it doesn't, well then you might want to go back a few steps. Um, so, if you say yes, to, does your personality match up with your characters? Then, I always move on to the next one. What's her outfit? You look at it. And the first question you ask while looking at the out that character's outfit is do you have enough skill in sewing skills to make that cosplay that, or that outfit? You look at the outfit itself. Do you think you can do that? Well, it's kind of just a ballerina outfit, so yeah. And then you look at the hair. You go and look up some wig places or you style your own hair or whatever. Can you find that person's hair or can you do it with your own hair personally? 
Well, I went and looked up. It took me a while. It took me a while. But I did look it up, and yes, people do make the wig. And so, that was a good. Then you look at the shoes. Can you find or can you find that person's shoes online or in a shoe store or something? Well, yeah, it's just ballet shoes, pointy. Sh it's just point shoes with like the flap tips. So, yeah. And then you look at any accessories or um, weapons or any of that stuff. Can you make or find that online? Well. She has a pendant necklace, and yes, I can find that. <laughs> it took a while, but yes, I would try to make it, but it's just way too complicated. So, yeah, I did find it online, on eBay, or was it Etsy? Etsy, it was Etsy, not eBay, so yeah. Then the next question about the outfit is, is it reasonable, and is it appropriate? <laughs> Most importantly, is it appropriate for what you're planning on wearing it to? Well, if I was planning on wearing it to school, probably not. But since I'm planning on wearing it for Halloween and con, then yeah, it's most definitely reasonable. I mean, come on. It's just a Halloween outfit. Come on, people. So, if that's yes, then move on to the next one. Does the style match your personality? Well, I love wearing gorgeous things. So, yeah. I love wearing dresses and stuff like that. So, and hence, scarf and necklaces and stuff like that. So, yeah. And then the last. The pointer is you have to stick with it. Numerous years, I always make sure I find the perfect one before I stick with it. I think of one. If I don't really like the idea, I think about it for a few days. And if I start to like, well, I don't know, then it's probably not right for you. So find the perfect one and once you find that one the answer is yes to all of those most importantly do you love that character that is most important if that's a yes then that's the right one for you and once you find that one once you find that character you stick with it I am telling you stick with it I spend days researching different characters to find the right one and make sure I'm going to love it when it is done. And most importantly, do you love that character and will you feel comfortable wearing that outfit? So, yeah. But most importantly, stick with it once you find that perfect character. Stick with it stick with it please stick with it because what if you're like halfway done with the cost you don't want to be like halfway done with the cosplay and then be like well actually now that I'm starting to work with it I don't know please stick with it once you start it's too late unless you're like really fast and have like a year to make the next costume but then you're going to want to go back to it. So find that perfect one first. But please find the perfect character first before you start working. So, yeah. So, that is it for today. Thank you guys so very much for listening. And do not, do not forget to like. And please, please, please subscribe. I want to get to like... 15 subscribers soon so please I only have four right now and I'm going to try to start making videos more frequently now so I've been going very very slow but 
now that I've got my own laptop, it'll be easier to, like, edit it and stuff like that. So, yeah, so thank you so, so much, and please, please do not forget to like and subscribe. Thank you, guys. Bye. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Greetings, loved ones. Let's take a journey. Place where the grass is really green.